biggest flagship schemes of the BRS government led by Chief Minister K. Chandrasekhar Rao is the Asara Pension Scheme. It is a scheme that is aimed at empowering the lives of the most vulnerable sections of the society. It's a pension scheme of different monetary value given to the poorest of poor, given to vulnerable sections such as the senior citizens, single women, widows, HIV patients, stonemasons and even handloom workers. Telangana is the only state in the country which also doles out ASRA pension scheme to BD workers. Recently, the state government, in what is being dubbed as a landmark order, decided to enhance the ASRA pension from existing 28 lakh beneficiaries to over 43 lakh beneficiaries in a bid to ensure inclusive and holistic growth even for those who are not able to sustain themselves due to their financial and physical conditions. Now the ASRA pension scheme, remember, has also seen an increase in budget. From earlier to now, the state government is spending over 970 crores to dole out this particular scheme to as many number of beneficiaries as possible. And like I told you earlier, the scheme covers senior citizens to BD workers. Now, the state government has also decided to reduce the pension age limit. Earlier, it was 65 and above who would be eligible to get the ASRA pension scheme. But now the state government has reduced that age limit to just 57 years. Not just that, Telangana, as I said, is among those few states and perhaps the only state in India which also doles out the pension to BD workers to empower them. Now, the pension for the physically disabled or the differently abled category has also been recently enhanced from 3,016 rupees to 4,016 rupees. Again, a decision taken by Chief Minister K. Chandrasekhar Rao receiving different appeals from different sections of the society in the wake of rising costs. Telangana is also amongst the only few states in India where the pensions are highest in the country. Perhaps it is the only state, as the state government claims, where the pension scheme covers not just the diverse population, but also an amount that ranges a minimum of 4,000 rupees. And the Chief Minister of Telangana, K. Chandrasekhar Rao, firmly believes that not just from the spectrum of politics, but this is a welfare scheme that needs to be only increased with every potential year. And that is a vision that is one of the key aspects of our Telangana government led by Chief Minister K. Chandrasekhar Rao. To give you some numerical values of how the Telangana's ASRA pension has been providing financial assistance, well, the minister, uh, quoting Minister Dayakar Rao, Erabali Dayakar Rao, he says that the increase in disability pension has only brought joy to differently abled members of the community. He also goes on to say that this is a scheme uh, where due to the increase in the number of pension amount, the disabled in the state will receive a financial assistance to the tune of 205 crore, 45 lakhs per month and he also explained that earlier Telangana or before the formation of Telangana only three lakh beneficiaries were eligible under the differently able scheme but after the formation of Telangana that number has in fact gone up severely not just that Telangana Chief Minister K Chandrasekhar Rao also believes that through ASRA pensions various groups mostly the vulnerable categories have found ways to run their businesses have found ways to not just support their livelihood but also support allied aspects of their family including being independent of rest of the family members and this has also ensured and given a sense of dignity to maximum number of beneficiaries which the state government of telangana believes is one of its topmost achievements not just that in 2014 the range of the scheme has also gone up multifold in 2014 the amount that is given per month under this pension scheme was 67 crores now that amount has gone up to a mammoth 976 crores because of the increasing number of beneficiaries and a special focus remember has been given to bd workers to single women to teachers retired teachers and also patients who have to regularly undergo dialysis. One of the flagship schemes of the Telangana government has also 
gotten widespread appreciation from the entire country as Telangana Chief Minister K. Chandrasekhar Rao dreams of coming up with Bangaru Telangana by ensuring inclusive growth and holistic growth more importantly for entire section of the population.